Hey, hello, hello. Mommy. Mommy. Hey. Hmm. You make all this so I can have a tip. <laughs> tip one. Because we're starving the boy. He cannot. Please. Uh, huh? You can take a chip. Yeah. We'll get a couple quarters out of the car. Go get one. Okay. And go sit and play on your cabin. I will. I'll get a quarter. No, oh, that was loud. Oh. Right. Go get your chips and get sit. Get a chip and go pl play on your tablet. Alrighty, so the job. demo is out. Uh, I've already played a little bit of it to see what it's like. <coughs> we got to choose who we want to be. Uh, we can play to level 7, as it says, and we only play the beginning of the story. Um, oddly enough, just like a Dragon Quest, yeah. you're able to continue uh, hey, the character oh, set them. into the real game. So, whether, whether I choose these or not. Mm -hmm. Okay, baby. Yep. So, we're going to choose to go on in. Yes, it's an auto save. Blah, blah, blah. We'll let you choose who we chose after the entrance goes. So, the graphics are definitely better. <laughs> By far, is in the collection of mana of actually fighting the the different dark beings. I haven't quite beaten it yet, but yes, go to sleep. Now the evil people go take over the world, blah, blah, blah. Peace was at an end. Go lay down over there. Huh? I'm talking to the kitty. Okay. Is there anything left in your cup? Because he's liable to knock it over. Music's a lot better, which is saying a lot because the music in the Super Nintendo was pretty good. I think it's about time to clean that monitor, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> I think it's actually about time to retire that monitor with all the scratches and stuff, isn't it? Yeah, it looks like somebody took a pen to it. So who do we get saying the name of the game? So far the times I've toyed with it, it rotates between the characters. I think you can actually push a button now. Trials of Mana! Alright, new game. Uh, I didn't even change that. It's, it's pointless. Normal. Now the key is, I'm not sure if we can play multiplayer with the demo. We're going to toy with it to see if it will once we get the second player. So you can go through the different characters to see who we have. Angela. Kevin. 
Kevin! Solid? It's solid! Okay. Reese. Ultimately, I think my characters I'm going to select in Trials, I'm playing Angela, Charlotte, and Duran. But I think for the full game, when I go to play it, it's actually going to be, oddly enough, all three of the girls. Reese, Angela, and Charlotte. But you can choose who you want. <laughs> who are their companions? Companion 2 should be Charlotte if you want Charlotte to be the, one of the characters. But. I am Reese. <laughs> so you're going to select the same three? <laughs> I think I'm going to go ahead and do a recording of all their intros too, just so that all of them are shown. The phone call. All right, so, uh, so just like mana, this the mana uh, statues are your main saves and heals. You can save at the he and heal at the end as well. In Altana, the kingdom of magicians. The true queen's magic was all that kept the freezing temperatures of the surrounding snowy lands at bay. But as the mana of the world grew weaker, so did her power. Bit by bit, the ice and cold began to encroach on the castle. Citizens! We all feel the magic draining from the land as mana weakens. For our mighty kingdom of Altena, this is a grave concern. We shall not sit idly while our country crumbles. No, no. we must open the forbidden portal to the sanctuary of mana, and then we can obtain the sword of mana. I thought that we tried to manage the great magic from the same person. Legend says the portal to the sanctuary of mana only appears after activating the mana. They just cloned them all, I guess. Yeah. Obviously, no country would willingly give up a precious mana stone, so we expect a certain amount of resistance. Shall muster our strength and take the mana stones by force. Our true queen will obtain the sword of mana to rule her magic empire. Long live the true queen! Glory to Altena! Oh, come on, Jose! No need to shout, your highness. Honestly, you know, I used to be the sharpest of the great magic users in the Altanish court. Yeah. Whoa, 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 hang on. I do not need another trip down your winding memory lane. <laughs> Just teach me the rest of yesterday's lesson. <laughs> I've told you time and time again. You cannot use magic simply by learning the steps. Your magic has not manifested because you rely on form instead of spirit. Oh, please, not another lecture. Fine, I just won't ask for lessons anymore then. Take that. Me. Mm. This child. Is your child 
sleep yet. <laughs> lessons already? You know, Jose complains to me whenever you skip lessons, right? Please consider my plight next time, Your Highness. Angela, <laughs> princess and heir to the throne of Altena. It may be a little bit before With we get to a second character anyway. So. Angela grew up fatherless in the shadow of her mother's royal duties. Her childhood was extremely lonely. Instead of affection from her mother, it seemed all she received were scoldings. Though she knew that the queen had important responsibilities that kept the two from playing, that knowledge didn't stop Angela's frustrated tears. Starved for attention, the princess grew into a rebellious youth. She often acted out, playing pranks on members of the court. Though Angela became a renowned beauty, much like her mother, she remained woefully unable to wield the magic power of her bloodline. That lack of talent was never far from her mind. Now, ultimately, the problem with Angela is her spell casting slow as crap. So she, once she starts getting magic and we have to start using it, it'll become really, really slow in the process. Uh, can you walk around the chair, please? Thank you. And how tapping on top of it opens the chest, I'm not sure. I actually haven't played her as the main character yet, so don't know how it impacts the storyline. Victor was searching for you, but we must look around and find everything. Dash. Okay. Run. Just because you told me to do it. So we got a star ahead, star through there. Let's go check this first. They're practicing their magic. They're not doing anything. They're not doing anything. <laughs> They're not doing a very good job at it then. Shiny! An item seed already. You hiding anything in here? In your bedrooms? Some nice beds for just standard people walking around. Shiny! You barrel through your conversation. Candy! Your queen is important meeting something about the fate of the kingdom or such. <laughs> Alright, so that was it. Useless. Come outside and go back in. This is urgent. 
moment. Her Majesty is preparing our troops to invade Valsena across the sea. We must go to her, Your Highness. But there's a shiny over here! Anything on the other side? No? Okay. Please enter, Your Highness. Uh, Your Majesty, I believe you sent for me. Angela, allow me to explain. As you know, we must control the mana stones to gain access to the sanctuary. That is the reason for our uh, invasion. Legend says if we activate the energy of the mana stones in the world, the portal will open. And we don't question legend. We shall begin with the Altenish mana stone. Mommy. Uh, how will you Mommy. do that? Mm. Give me a we will drag. use a forbidden magic spell. Our in a bit, baby. takes the life of the enchanter in exchange for that mana energy. However, my associate and I are too important for this sacrifice. If we use your body as a vessel for that cursed magic, your death would act as the catalyst we need to release the Mana Stone's true power. How'd you get that, Mama? <laughs> You've been a useless lag on my lineage for far too long. To think that my daughter could be so weak and powerless. That's terrible! In these circumstances, sacrificing yourself with a spell is the most fitting end for me. Now come, my child. No! <laughs> She's gone. But that's the catalyst for her magic to start working. <laughs> Obviously. <laughs> yeah, she's actually the main character for what I'm playing on the collection at the moment. Mm. So I know roughly how her storyline's gonna go, so I definitely won't have her as the main character when I actually play it. I'll pick somebody that I haven't seen the storyline for. <sighs> So I was kind of glad you did pick her because I do know roughly what her storyline works. Where? I'm outside the castle. But why? Why would my mother? I'm actually kind of curious about Kevin's story. Actually, I have no idea what to do now. Village to the east? That might be my only option at this point. No shinies, okay. Shiny! <laughs> oh my god. Are you sure we gotta play with her? <laughs> I'm already, I can already tell I'm gonna be irritated with her voice. Yeek! If she's gonna do that every time she jumps. <laughs> I've done this much to know exactly what I gotta do for fighting, so. It's just smashing buttons, really. Isn't that most games, though? Yeah, most hack and slash time. Let's 
see what's up here real quick. Looks like a whole lot of nothing. Oh, no, there's a bug. For a mage, she sure is actually doing pretty well for herself. Leveled up already. Leveled up, increase your hit points and stats like your strength, blah, blah, blah. Alright, so training. So far, from what I can tell when I was toying with it, this is actually totally different on how the stats and stuff work. Um, kind of a more modernized version of it. Uh, I have no clue what I would want to take her towards, though. Uh, well, getting her towards point uh, magic would probably be a good idea. Learned Holy Bolt. I don't think she can get Holy Bolt yet. She needs the spirit first. Hey, look up. Did I get the chest? Um. Yes, I did. It's gray up there. Uh, that way or that way? Right. Where are you going? Uh, that was a nice miss. <laughs> You won! Get used to seeing that because that's going to be the game. She is a lot slower to kill than most of the other characters because her staff is really weak compared to that everybody else attacked. So that's the one thing we have an issue with right now. She has no magic, so it's going to take a while to <laughs> kill things. I think even Charlotte can actually do more damage than she can if she's a healer. I am really surprised I'm not taking more damage when I am though. You selected Reese as the second character, right? I can't remember. Uh, what? <laughs> so we're not going that direction. Looks like we go that way at some point. you toy with it for a little bit so you can at least learn to combat a little bit. <laughs> she needs to heal soon too so hopefully... Oh you might want to go back to the statue to heal. I just thought about that. There's also something up there. Yes. 
<laughs> She's a little monkey. Statue? Uh, right, should be down through the the little left passage there. Oh. Turn around. Of course, you're gonna have to fight to get there. But I ran right past it. I should have used it. Okay, down, down that passage there. Yep, to the right. I didn't realize she was that low health. Which I was just calling that she wasn't getting hurt very much. She's actually gonna gain a level here shortly. <laughs> nope. She healed from the level too, so go ahead and save it. Save early, save often. This is one of those games that came very apparent. Alright, back the way we came. We'll hold that point for later. I think it's down that way. <laughs> More fighting! Yay! Yeah, if you use kind of a combo of the two attacks, the power attack and the regular attack, you'll... She'll do combo moves. <laughs> really? Where were we? We could have just triggered this in earlier. Oh well. It's too cold. I can't take another. Step. What do you expect with what you're wearing? Jeez. Yeah. <laughs> Good a bit of this is going to be intro, unfortunately, so... Alright, investigate the town a little bit and then we'll save it. We've got enough time to do that. Because there's still more storyline stuff going to happen. Actually, we may be able to finish her part completely. I think we'll have enough time to do that. Because really, I think all she's got to do is talk to the. Um, what do you call it? Fortune teller. From what I remember. Of course, that's as long as it hasn't changed her storyline some from the original. No, don't bother her. But I'll play with you. Get you a drink in a moment. You'll live without it for a few. We got juice in the refrigerator back there. Huh? We got juice in the refrigerator. We can get you in a moment. Always look for shinies. <laughs> He's sleeping, baby. I'm ruffling backwards, baby. The kitties oh. don't like that much. He doesn't like that much. <laughs> What's this? Decoration. Leave it alone. What does decoration do? 
Check to see if you can get a better weapon, Mike, before you go too far to in the weapon shop back there. Probably the earlier you get her weapon upgraded, the better. <laughs> of course, they're still dancing. Don't know why. They dance it throughout the Mana series. Welcome. <laughs> oh, yeah, 50? Yeah. Well, that's what she's got. She's already got that. Never mind. So, no change. <laughs> We'll get you juice once we finish doing this part. Go play with your tablet. We'll, be, we'll get you something in a moment. Uh, you can use the item seed too. Didn't really show much of this in the collection, would I? You just plant random seeds and they give you random items. Nice. I don't know exactly why. And half the time I don't use hardly any of the items either. That's the weird thing. Yep, <laughs> fortune teller already. So. Ma'am, I don't know what to do. Please give me guidance. Hmm. Sometimes people lose everything. Oddly enough, that I'm pretty sure it's multiple people that goes to the same fortune teller. When that happens. You must go to Holy City Wendell and seek advice from his eminence, the Priest of Light. The Priest of Light? To find your way <coughs> through the darkness of despair, you will need a guiding light. Go to Wendell, child. That is your fate. Come on! This broad told me the same thing. Go to Wendell or whatever. All I ask is whether my next child is going to be a boy or a girl. <laughs> <laughs> you need to go to the <laughs> Priest of Light, apparently, to find that out. He knows everything. He sees all. Why we need fortune tellers? I don't know. He, apparently, he's the one you know, need to go to. I don't know what awaits me there, but I guess it's bound to be better than getting caught here in my own kingdom. I'll go. I mean, nothing could possibly be worse than staying cooped up in a castle. And if I learn how to handle my magic, maybe my mother will welcome me back. There's a chance at least. Just do it. Heart heavy with the Queen's rejection. Angela left Altena as a wanted criminal with a price on her head. Do I get one? I do. We gotta come over here to do that. Hmm. Please, I'm dying of thirst. I'm dying of thirst. Help me. We're almost done. Mwah. Oh, I know he's to pass out of my lap now. It'll be okay. So, this is your drink. I don't know how to. Yeah, it's empty. What, what in the world is this? Looks like a vacuum cleaner to me. Welcome back to the Queen Earth Cleaner to clean. Yeah, that's what it's for, to clean. For what? Like... This scene here is played through all of the characters. Because all of their basic storyline works the same. It just, their overall, what they're going there for is different. Ah. And... At certain points of the the game, it, it veers off depending on who you are to, <laughs> and who your companions are. Certain events change depending on what companion you have. So. so 
Auto saved here. We're gonna let this enter a finish. Belongs to Ferolia. Don't resist, and we may spare you. Ferolian forces have taken the town and closed the docks. So now my ship's stuck in the harbor until who knows when. Don't know what I was expecting, but I don't like the look of these beastmen. Alright. Uh, can we save it? I don't know if we can. Since we're kind of close to the end. Nope, we can't. So, it auto saved before we enter, so we'll have to see that again. But, alright, that's maybe the first episode of this. Uh, like, subscribe, comment. We'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye. Take it easy.